Today I show you how to switch from Bixby on Samsung Galaxy Android devices to Gemini. Now in One UI 7, you can use the actual assistant Gemini and go to settings, advanced features, side button. And here you have the option for even for double press, you can set a command for that. If you assign a long press to the power button to the Google Gemini, you can still use the combination of the power button and volume to power off your Android phone, the Samsung, or you can use the power button in the quick settings menu. Here I can choose Bixby or the power off menu, or I can use the digital assistant app, which is the Google app, or I can even use ChatGPT or other digital assistant apps. Now a long press on the power button opens Gemini. What's the weather today? It figures out the location and the units to display and the town and... In Larnaca, it's 25 and sunny. Tonight, the forecast is for a high of 24 and a low of 19 and mostly cloudy. Okay, finally. This is much better and this way in One UI 7 you have the full integration as a digital assistant with Gemini. Set a timer for 3 seconds. I set a timer for 3 seconds. I hope this video helps you set the digital assistant you prefer and if you didn't try Gemini and you use Bixby, give it a try, it might work much better. Thanks for watching, I hope this helps you.